Eric, it's mom. I wanted to show you how to change the power level on a microwave. I'm going to show you first how you would change it on our fancier microwave at home, and then how you would change it on your microwave that you have at your house. Okay, give me one second. So the question now becomes, when do you use different power levels and why? So starting from the lowest to the highest, I'll tell you how I would use it. Power level one or two, I would use for something like softening butter. If you're making a recipe and it calls for softened butter, you don't wanna just stick the butter in there, nuke it and have it um, melt all over the inside of the microwave. So one or two power setting will help you just soften butter. And then if we move up a little bit higher, three or four will help, um, you know how I like my ice cream kind of melted -y? Uh, That will help do that. It'll soften the ice cream without melting it all the way. Uh, when you move up to five and six, I would use that, I would probably use a six if I were gonna heat up milk. You know when you heat up milk too fast and you get that filmy stuff on the top and it's really gross and you don't like it? I would use a five or six to heat up the milk or dairy so that doesn't happen. Six or seven I might use for something like a lasagna or a casserole that might have dairy or something on the outside and that's real dense. So you want the inside of it to cook before the outside of it burns. And then of course, nine or 10 is just, you know, regular stuff that you wanna cook. Okay, I hope that helps you with the power settings. I will see you soon, bye. Okay, our microwave at home is a fancy brand. And so the way that you do it on this one is that you will hit power level first, and then you will hit which power level you want, let's say 60%. And then it's gonna ask you to enter the time. So I'll say 10 seconds. And then you just hit start. Easy as that. And I'm your mom, so I'll always tell you not to stand in front of the microwave while it's cooking. Um, then I'm going to show you how to do this on the type of microwave that you probably have at school. Hey, me again. I came to the office to show you how to change the power setting on a different type of microwave. Um, so I'm showing you the one at the office, which is more of a basic kind of microwave, more like what you'll probably have. Here's a look at it. So on this type of microwave, you'll first put in the time that you're going to cook. So let's say you're going to cook something for 20 seconds. You'll put that in first, then you'll hit power. And it's at 100% power, so if you want 40% power, you just push four and it shows you that it's going to 40% power, and then you click start. I'm just gonna stop that. That's it, pretty easy.